I'm at the salon all day, okay? So the kids' tea's in the freezer. All you got to do is get it out. That's fine, Bradley, out. How do you mean? What, like, out? Out. Because? Who knows? So the only, the only thing is, but I mean, Bradley ain't got anywhere to stay. He don't want to go back to Rachel's. I mean, I, I don't blame him, so that means... No. Uh, come on. No, he's not staying here. Well, it makes sense. Not to me. Tanya. Look, as if I haven't got enough to worry about, well, with Mickey who knows where doing who knows what, all I've got is Joe and a paintbrush, and we open on Thursday, listen, listen, remember? I know things are tough. I know things are tough, but this won't get in the way of the cellar. We haven't got room. We'll make room. It's not fair on the girls. <laughs> what are you talking about? Well, look, this move has been hard enough on them as it is. Don't make it tougher. Yeah, well, they will love having him here. Yeah? Right, well, let's ask him, shall we? Laura, will you come in here? What about Abby? She's too young. Oh, what, so Lauren decides? Yeah, she's got a right. It's called democracy. <laughs> yeah, and if I just say he's coming. You know better than that. Just about come here. Sit down. Right, come here. How would you feel, right, mm -hmm. if Bradley came to stay? What? Like, live here? For a bit. Does he have to? Well, it'd be fun. You'll have someone to play with. You'd like that, wouldn't you? I don't need anyone to play with. Yeah, I know you don't need anyone. Well, where's he going to sleep? Uh. Well, I'm not sharing with Abby. Yeah, I mean, that's okay. I don't want him to come. 